On for the first time tonight, we are witnessing video of the bullying of 10-year-old Saquon Haskins. Now, the Appomattox County child was verbally and physically assaulted by two teenage boys on board a school bus back in May 2011. James Girardi was at a press conference in Appomattox County this afternoon. James, the press conference was held by Saquon's mom to show friends and family how bad this really was. Yeah, Mark, tonight we're showing you what really happened on board that school bus. Roxanne Haskins, Saquon's mother, says she wants all parents to see how disturbing and traumatic bullying truly is. Were the words that triggered the screams. <laughs> Forty grueling minutes of physical and verbal bullying, all caught on tape aboard the school bus transporting 10-year-old Saquon Haskins. Some parts harder to watch than others. There, the two teens, 15-year-old schoolmates of Haskins, hold a hot cigarette lighter to his skin. The abuse included name-calling, racial, and sexual slurs. Bus driver Nancy Davis can be heard as well. Months ago, the tape played a crucial part in her child neglect trial. An Appomattox County jury acquitted her of all charges. My son, he was a special need child, and he didn't deserve this. He was entitled to a safe transportation, just like any other child in the Appomattox County public school system. But she says instead, her son was left with physical and emotional scars. Since the incident, he's received hours of therapy and been diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder. And I wanted parents to be aware that if, when I speak out, I'm speaking out for all kids. But unfortunately, this did happen to my child. And I want parents, you know, to be aware of what's going on in the school system. Both teens on board the bus were found guilty of disorderly conduct and assault and battery back in 2011. Currently, Haskins is awaiting a trial date in her civil case against the Appomattox County School Board. Reporting live in the Lynchburg Newsroom, James Girardi, ABC 13 News.